I want to tell you what happened last week to me. It was after a training session I held on Monday. And I hold a special training session for a group of my traders every single day. But Monday is a very special training session for a group of my traders. And one of these traders reached out to me and, and, and begged and said, Oliver, listen, I really need to speak to you because I'm at or on my last leg here. I immediately reached out to the trader. And the trader told me, Oliver, listen. I just experienced, I was just in the training this Monday morning. And once again, I find myself motivated. You, Oliver, are a master motivator. And it's one of the reasons I chose you to be my mentor because I've never met someone who can motivate me the way you motivate me. And today, Oliver, he told me, I am once again motivated. I came into this Monday wanting to quit, wanting to end this activity, but once again, I am fired up. I'm motivated. But Oliver, I know what's going to happen. What is going to happen later today or tomorrow, Tuesday, or maybe it might take until Wednesday, but what's going to happen to me is what happens to me every week. Oliver, I'm going to lose my motivation. I'm going to have a series of bad trades today or tomorrow, and the motivation that you gave me today is going to disappear. This is my reality, Oliver, he told me, every single week of my life. You pick me up. You give me that shot in the arm that I need every Monday morning. But by Wednesday, Oliver, it's gone. And almost every Friday, I want to quit. And he told me, Oliver, I'm on this, this terrible emotional cycle and I want it to end. I don't want to be on this roller coaster. Help me. And I instantly told this trader that, listen, you don't need any more motivating. You don't need any more motivation. You see, motivation is not your problem. You've got motivation. I provide you that motivation. At times, you provide yourself that motivation. Motivation is not your problem, trader. You know what your problem is? You need more discipline. Motivation you have up the wazoo. Motivation you have internally at times from yourself. Motivation sometimes comes from a quote, sometimes comes from an Instagram post you scroll through. Sometimes motivation comes from a loved one. Sometimes motivation comes from a movie. Sometimes motivation comes from Oliver Velez. You have enough motivation in your life, but what you don't have enough of is discipline. And I went on to continue to explain to this trader that there is a vast world of difference between being motivated and being disciplined. And today, I want to delve into those differences. You see, traders, motivation is not designed to last. Motivation, while important, will never last. Motivation is like the java shot you receive from a potent cup of coffee motive but it it gives you that shot but it doesn't last motivation is like the adrenaline that you get in the midst of a sporting event and after that sporting event is over that level of adrenaline does not last Motivation is that brief period of euphoria that you experience during special moments in your life. But you are living at the height of naivety if you believe those special euphoric highs will last forever. They don't. I am not telling you that motivation doesn't have a value. I am not telling you that motivation is needed. I, my, part of my responsibility is to motivate you. But you've got to understand that if you're relying 100% on your motivation taking you to the finish line, you are going to be sorely disappointed. 
Motivation is not a deliverer. Being motivated and rah, rah, being fired up will not get you to the finish line. Motivation will not get you to the land of profitability. Motivation will not get you to mastery. Motivation is not the deliverer. But discipline is. Discipline is what gets you to the finish line. Discipline is what carries you through when motivation quits and stops working for you. Discipline is what picks your head up off of the pillow when you are depressed every single morning. Discipline is what keeps you going when the, when the going is as tough of, as it's ever been in your life. It's discipline that makes you wake up at four o'clock in the morning to study when your body doesn't wanna wake up four o'clock in the morning to study. It's discipline that keeps you going despite the pain, despite the embarrassment, despite the evidence proving all of your haters right, despite the evidence proving every naysayer in your life right. What keeps you going in the face of that and in the face of that hardship is your discipline. Discipline is the only thing that will carry you all the way to the finish line. And if you've got motivation without discipline, then you will never make it. And I've always told you that my mother, I grew up with my mother constantly saying, Oliver, you use the word never too much. Never say never, Oliver. Well, mom, I'm sorry, never. Motivation without discipline does not cut it. Is it needed? Yes. Do you need a shot in the arm every now and then? Yes. Do you need a positive talk from me every now and then to get you off your hiney and start applying your work ethic to what you need to apply it to? Absolutely. We all need a push at times. We all need an outside force getting our mindset right at times. But if you're relying on that, to achieve your mastery, you're gonna be disappointed. It's not meant for that, it's not designed for that. It's the Java shot. It's the temporary high to get you off your ass every now and then. And we all need it, I need it at times as well.